The rain at the Tri-State Big Airport's slowing traffic, delaying some flights and canceling others. But the hardest hit today, no question, was LaGuardia Airport. And the hardest hit terminal at LaGuardia has been Terminal A. The one otherwise known as the Marine Air Terminal. The only LaGuardia terminal that isn't new and still isn't raised on stilts yet. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles is live at LaGuardia. Darla? Sade, then Bill, the last word we've heard from Port Authority is that Terminal A is closed until further notice. That does not mean this evening. It may not even mean tomorrow because I want to show you there's a massive cleanup and drying operation underway. You can see crews that have the doors wide open so they can get some fresh air in. All of the world, uh, the, the floors in there are very slick and it's very difficult and dangerous, obviously, to walk on those slick floors. Um, but I can tell you, Bill Sade, this still looks like a tropical resort to compare to what it looked like eight hours ago. An early morning passenger calling this his Uber boat ride to the airport. Apparently two feet of water on Grand Central Parkway, a truck and two sedans that tried to drive through, apparently getting stuck. We just got through the airport, it's flooded. Right now, we're going crazy. That same round of Friday morning flash flooding, claiming Marine Terminal A at LaGuardia Airport. Passengers are seen barefoot and wading into the front door. Some standing on benches to avoid getting wet. To rain, a lot of confusion, no information, and nobody to direct us to right way. You can, you know, what a lot of like damn, she thought out of there. Two airlines operate out of Terminal A, Spirit, and Frontier. Those flights were delayed, rerouted, or canceled. Port Authority sending out updates all day, but passengers say the airlines have not. Nothing. If we didn't get no alerts or anything, they didn't notify us and caught so we were dry, we found no alerts to make it. And while crews worked to pump water out of the building, passengers were bused to other terminals where they say there was more confusion. If I street the right, no, just wanted to leave. Yeah. Just wanted to leave. Just got an update, uh, Bill Sade, in my ear that we now know from Port Authority that Terminal A will reopen tomorrow morning at 4.30 a.m. Again, Marine Terminal A will open tomorrow morning. Uh, but if you did just see the shot, we still see passengers who um, are not getting the updates online that the terminal is still closed this evening. So again, remember to make sure you check your airlines for all that information. Again, Marine Terminal A will reopen tomorrow morning at 4.30 a.m., but I have spoken to passengers who say they are not taking any chances that they have rebooked their flights out of Newark Airport.